Alright, so today I'm going to show you what I did. Um, basically, it's Friday harvest day, so we did a lot of stuff. Um, this plant right here is kale. And what I did was, there's a bunch of it over there, there's a bunch here. Um, there's some more over there, there's a bunch of it all over the place. But basically, I had to clip the kale. Um, separate the good from the bad. And uh, that took a while because there's a bunch of kale here. And then uh, after that was done, um, we took it up towards the house and then we separated it. And um, then I got to uh, get some of this over here and this plant right here. I don't remember what it's called, but basically there's three layers and you have to strip it down to the bare bone and then cut it at the V-line, about an inch up, so that you can replant it. Um, there's little plants at the bottom that you would take out and um, you chop it about, I don't know, half an inch um, so you can replant it so they can regrow. And uh, yeah, did a bunch of that and uh, that took a while. I did about five hours of work today. Uh, every day I feed the chickens, you know, in the morning. And, um... Oh yeah, I'll show you exactly what the bottom looks like. I have a little bit of pieces over here. But yeah, that took a while, so it's been, it's been a lot. This is the bottom right here basically like chop it and then you know like whatever is left over here so that should be pretty good and that's basically what I did today mmm lunch look at that avo tomatoes broccoli and uh, some of what I was telling you I was cutting earlier some kale and then some uh, custard plants. Isn't that nice? Yummy. So the other day I said I was going to go down here. It's a gulch area and there's nothing but trees. The woods basically. So I'm going down there right now. So follow me. Let's go. Might be a bumpy ride, so if the camera shakes at all, don't worry. I've never went down here before, so this is going to be quite interesting. Got it on camera too. You can see me on the floor, I know you can. All right. Check it out. I actually made it down here without dying. It actually wasn't that bad as you guys can see. Or as you guys did see, it wasn't that bad. So, let's get this little hike on the road. Yeah, 
can get pretty lost because it all looks the same. And if you look up the hill, you can't see the house at all. All right, so I clearly marked my spot as the red flag, or red bandana. So, as you can see, it goes on for a while. I mean, look, it goes on for a while. I don't know how long. I don't know how long I'll hike for either. I can go up a couple places as well. I'm not gonna go up anywhere though. Hear that chicken? Sounds really close. Oh, I see it. All right, so let's keep going. So that's about it. I'm not going any farther. So I hope you enjoyed. Let me catch my breath. I just straight like bulldozed it through here and I haven't stopped yet so this is my first time stopping. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching me on my little journey. I'll let you know when I get back home. Of course you'll know. I'll be videotaping it. That hill is just like straight uphill and everything's falling apart as you come up. It's crazy. But just wanted to let you know I made it back safely.